Welcome guys to the sneak preview of Kyle Francis Farm and Fly. Cheers, big ears. Belize is really unique. It's a tiny country with a ton of diversity. In a place like Ambergris Key, the windward side has the beaches, the reef. It started as a little fishing village, and now it's a bustling tourist town. The leeward side of the island has nothing. This side is all concentrated on flats fishing, bonefish, permit, tarpon, snook. And so I decided to make the kind of place that people visiting San Pedro, fishing with the guide in San Pedro, can get away from town for a night or two. We've been building this place for a year and a half. The nearest road is five miles away, so everything that we built had to be brought up here in a panga, in a okay. skiff. You can make electricity from the sun, did you know that? Oh, and it's crazy. Now, I mean, more people lived on the island 1,300 years ago than, than live on the island now. So literally everything that you see on the ground here that looks like pottery is pottery. I moved down here 14 years ago. I ran a punk rock record label and taught myself to become a chef. This is Chaya. This, oh, is, cool. this is what he had for breakfast. This is pretty much the last developed property until you hit Mexico. So you guys are legitimately getting a real preview of what's gonna be probably one of the more unique spots in the country. The fishery here is awesome, uh, it's world class, it's not easy at all, but there are probably few places as rewarding to fish as here. One of the advantages of being up here is you can leave at 6, come back at noon, have lunch, go back out again at 1, come back at 5, go back out and, and wade the flats at sunset if you want. You're not confined to a routine of fishing governed by time. My dream, this little area. You know what I mean? That's yeah. it. That's all you need. When you come to Belize, nothing's going to replace the guided experience. You know, the guides have invaluable knowledge, but for somebody fishing on their own, nothing's going to give you more freedom and better access to water than one of these paddle boards. What these are today, compared to even the one that we had at our resort four years ago, they're more stable, they're easier to paddle, they're more well thought out, and they're awesome. So, what's the deal, Jeff? Everywhere we went to in Belize, everyone knew you. Um, you move down here to a small island, right. it's in your best interest to never forget it's a small island. Uh, these people, you know, some of them might be your staff, but they're, they're your friends, they're your neighbors, uh, and if you treat them like that, you'll enjoy making this your home. Yeah, thanks for coming, guys, and you're gonna wanna come back soon. All right, let's go fish. <laughs>